Hi everybody, Sean with jazbeescasebreaks.com here doing a late night 2020 Panini Donruss Elite Football 6 box half case break pick your team number 3. Thank you to all that got involved, especially our last spot mojo. We ended up getting 6 spots to fill this up for the night and get this going. Thomas Rifle, thank you very much. Uh, here's the list of everybody involved. Thomas Rifle, like I said, last spot mojos uh, five times. Seahawks, Patriots, Saints, Giants, and the Detroit Lions. Uh, pick your team number three. Half case is going to be coming from a new case. So we have a sealed case right here. I'm going to open this up, take out all six boxes, and put a left side and a right side. And we're going to figure out which boxes we're going to do in this case. The last, the, the other six are going to be saved for pick your team number four. Which is in the store, jazbeescasebreaks.com. So if you see, like what you see here, guys, and you want to get your team and they're available, go ahead and pick them up. So we're going to part the C, left side, right side. As you can see, there's 12 boxes, six on the right, six on the left. We're going to do one, two, and three on the left, four, five, and six on the right on this dice roll. Here's the dice. Maybe. There you go. You can see normal dice. Nothing special, except for I like this one. Roll the dice, and we ended up with a five, which means we're going on the right-hand side, guys. So boxes on the left are going to be for pick your team number four, which I'm going to write on right now. So you can see the front here. We're going to go four, four. Like I said, this is in the store, so if you'd like... You can go ahead and get into these now. Boom. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up these boxes one by one. I'm going to stack all the packs, and then we're going to go through them. What's up, Mr. Mike today? How you doing? Doing very good. We're doing a six-box half-case break of Elite right now. We've got like three other breaks that are like four spots or three spots away from breaking, including soccer and two baseball. So we've got some stuff we can do, guys. It all depends on if anybody wants to do it with us. See? Mr. Mike's daddy loves Elite. We're going we're gonna to have to get a whole, uh, whole spoonful of it right now, guys. Yeah, you can get some really nice stuff out of here. Lots of parallels. Lots of uh, autos.
Uh, Steve, I don't remember. I think I've only done like one half of this. Like one six box break of this. We've done two random teams and also obviously two other uh, pick your teams. I don't remember what the biggest was. I'm trying to, rem I, I think like, they definitely have a nice look to them. You know what it kind of reminds me of, Mr. Mike's Daddy? Do you remember uh, XR last year? It reminds me of that a little bit. Um, I want to say like I hit an auto like a like a Jerry Judy or a CeeDee Lamb or like a like a Henry Ruggs, like a bigger wide receiver auto. But like between this and Luminance, I kind of it kind of blurs as far as which autos I've hit. Because I did um, I did a, a Luminance break not too long ago where I hit some like ridiculous autos out of that too. So, but yeah, the styling looks just like a XR, doesn't it? Which XR was an awesome product too. So, obviously they like the styling and the design. So I'm wondering if this is the design for Elite, what the design for XR will be. And then obviously for the rookies, the pen pal autographs, this is their first uh, autos in, yeah, not only two Burroughs autos, but a Burroughs case hit, a Burroughs parallel to 50, and one of those Bur Burroughs dynamics. So like there was five like very, very mentionable Joe Burroughs cards in that one half case. That was only a half case, Sam. That was only six boxes. I mean, nine cases. Good luck, everyone. Mr. Mike Teddy, was that a was that elite or was that a luminous? Uh, Marlon Davidson to 799 for the Atlanta Hawks. Or sorry, Atlanta Falcons. Jarrell Taylor on that one. Uh, Patrick Queen. I think these are awesome looking cards. No numbering. These two. Clyde Edwards Hilaire. I mean, just for like an unnumbered insert, those things are cool looking. Drew Locke, Relic. Denver Broncos. William Dora. Jacob Eason. To 3.99. For the Indianapolis Colts, that's going to Derek Disser. Cole McDonald to seven ninety nine for the Tennessee Titans and Eric Ainge. Chase Young to three ninety nine Washington Redskins Jerry Bennington. Clavon Chase on to eighty two. The Jacksonville Jaguars and Robert Garicki. Pen Pals Auto. Michael Pittman Jr. Going to Indianapolis Colts. Derek Disser. Uh, not on the regular cards, but on the Pen Pal autographs. This is their first card in their official pro jerseys. The base cards and parallels, no. Pen pal autographs, yes. 
So not too bad. So that's the significance of these cards, is this is going to be their first cards in pro jerseys, even if it's not all of them. Tom Brady, spellbound to 349 for the New England Patriots. You can see the numbering there. 300 of 349, New England Patriots, Thomas Rifle. DJ Moore, Elite Deck. Miles Sanders to 399, going to the Philadelphia Eagles. And David Ross. Grant Delpit, Rookie Elitist. I think this is a cool looking set too. Very simple. Derrick Henry to 99, Spellbound, Red. Tennessee Titans, Eric Ainge. Nice. Passing the torch, Josh, Josh Jacobs autograph, 66 out of 99. Going to the Las Vegas Raiders and Tony Regatuso. Congrats, Tony. Very nice running back there. As much as it, it hurts to me to say as a Chargers fan. LaMichael Pirine to 799 for the New York Jets and Tom Gatos. Lynn Bowden Jr. to 99. Nice looking parallel there for the Las Vegas Raiders. Also going to Tony Regatuso. Kenny Galladay, Playmakers. Nick Bosa, Elite Deck. Deshaun Watson. Nick Bosa to 399 for the 49ers. Going to Michael Armstrong. This is Adam Thielen to 19. Very short printed. Die cut there. Minnesota Vikings, Sam Roll. Christian McCaffrey, star status to 349. Nice looking card. Carolina Panthers, Steven Olson. Get these out of the way real quick. We'll keep going, guys. Teddy, if you shut it down, let people know we're still on YouTube. Next box, guys. Yeah, the Christian McCaffrey is nice, huh? I mean, that Josh Jacobs auto out of 99. Very cool looking. He would have been a uh, rookie of the year if he hadn't gotten hurt.
Um, that'd be cool. I mean, they got to find a way to use him. Apparently, he was a wide receiver before he converted to quarterback because of people being hurt. In I think he was was he at Kentucky or was he at Memphis? Was he? I think he was Memphis, right? Wherever he was, apparently he was he was a wide receiver before they had to convert him. Kentucky, okay. So yeah, he was a wide receiver before they had to convert him to a quarterback because apparently injuries or something like that. But I mean, with everybody trying to chase the next Taysom Hill type situation. Yeah, I mean, I don't know how big he is, but I know Khalil Tate from Arizona. He's a big guy. And that guy's fast, too. I mean, depending on how the Raiders season goes, who knows what Gruden's going to do. I have a feeling that uh, if Derek Carr doesn't, like, sh absolutely shine, like, absolutely kill it, they might uh, they might make him available for trade if anybody wants him. And uh, they might let Mariota start. I just think it's funny because didn't didn't Derek Carr buy a house right next to John Gruden's? That can get real awkward real quick. Not a big fan of Oregon quarterbacks. I mean that's understandable, but I mean, who, who nobody really thought anything of, like. LSU quarterbacks or Alabama quarterbacks or, you know, for a long time, too. All it takes is one to break that. Lamar Jackson. Elite. James Morgan to 99. New York Jets. Going to Tom Gatos. Uh, Jake Fromm, rookie on deck. Uh, Adam Troutman to seven ninety nine for the New Orleans Saints and Thomas Rifle. Joshua Kelly to three ninety nine for the Los Angeles Chargers and Sam Roll. Philip Lindsay to 399. Denver Broncos going to William Doro. Michael Thomas to 99 for the New Orleans Saints. And Thomas Rifle. Pen Pal Autos. KJ Hamler for the Denver Broncos. Denver Broncos and William Doro. Congrats, William. Another good team in my division that I'm kind of worried about. Cooper Cup to 349. Spellbound for the LA Rams. That's going to Eric Ainge. Darius Leonard to 47 for the Indianapolis Colts. Colts is going to Dirk Disser. Raekwon Davis to 
to 799 for the Dolphins. That's going to Thomas Reichel. Tua Tagovailoa. That's nice. Not numbered, but very nice rookie there. Also going to Thomas Rifle, the Dolphins. Not one of his last spot mojo spots, but Lamar Jackson, elite deck. DK Metcalf, swagger, dual relic, Seattle Seahawks, and Thomas Rifle. Last spot mojo. Julian Aquara to three ninety nine for the Detroit Lions and Thomas Rifle. Last spot mojo. Isaiah Simmons, rookie on deck. Full throttle, Saquon Barkley to 75. Nice looking card there. That's weird. You can actually see the number print through the front. I don't think you're supposed to be able to see it that well. But uh, New York Giants, that's going to Thomas Rifle. Last spot mojo. Justin Jefferson, rookie auto to 49 for the Minnesota Vikings and Sam Roll. Congrats, Sam. I think he's here with us in the chat. Or he was. Now he's looking out for a, looking for a Justin Herbert auto. Michael Pittman to 7.99. Indianapolis Colts, Derek Disser. Teddy Bridgewater to 3.99 for the Carolina Panthers and Steven Olson. Henry Ruggs to third, rookie elitist. That's box two. Box three. There you go, Sam. I, as a Chargers fan, I'd like to pull you a Herbert. You have, uh, you have the, yeah, you do have Packers in this too. So Jordan Love also opportunities there. AJ Dillon. You had two the other day, Chris. Nice. find an allocation like that for Sam here. Who was the duel with? Was it another Charger or was it an LSU? Like Justin Jefferson or... Josh Kelly? Nice. I like him.
Oh, it was a uh, dual auto with Jalen Hurts. Clyde Edwards Hilaire to seven ninety nine. Kansas City Chiefs. That is going to Rocio Elhami. And then uh, Thomas Rifle. Here's a little uh, little karma for last spot mojo for you. I don't think it's autographed, but Drew Brees, one of one Super Bowl champion. Tidal waves. There you go. Devontae Parker to 49 for the Miami Dolphins. Thomas Rifle. Uh, somebody mentioned him earlier. Denzel Mims. New York Jets auto. Tom Gatos. J.K. Dobbins, rookie elitist. Uh, we're going to do a randomizer at the end of the break, guys, where we figure out this is going to be the one spot, two spot, three spot, four spot, where all of these goes. If they're numbered, obviously it'll go to... Um, uh, it'll be different, but um, all of these will be going in one group to you know whatever spots in there there you go tom uh jake Fromm to 399 buffalo bills that's going to tony regatuso James Lynch to 799 for the Minnesota Vikings. That's going to Sam Roll. KJ Hamler. Parallel. Christian McCaffrey, spellbound to 75. Going to the Carolina Panthers and Steven Olson. Adam Thielen, Relic, for the Minnesota Vikings, Sam Roll. Danny Amendola to 80, for the Detroit Lions, and Thomas Rifle, last spot mojo. Jonathan Taylor, rookie on deck. Nick Chubb, Playmakers. Tyreek Hill, auto. Passing the torch, auto, to 49. Kansas City Chiefs, Rocio Elhami. Congrats. I don't agree with him as a person, but he's a damn good wide receiver and fast as hell. 799, Baltimore Ravens. Aaron Billingsley. Phillip Rivers. Indianapolis Colts to 399. Indianapolis Colts, Derek Disser. Hurts me to see him in a jersey other than the Chargers, but I wish him the best. I hope he gets a Super Bowl if the Chargers can't. Uh, full throttle to 349 for the Seattle Seahawks, DK Metcalf. And Seattle Seahawks is going to Thomas Rifle. Josh Allen, Buffalo Bills. Ezekiel Elliott to 24. Really low numbered there. 
die cut going to the Dallas Cowboys and Rick Thomas. Deshaun Watson, elite deck. T. Higgins, rookie on deck. And that's box number three. Nice box. Still got half the way to go, guys. Let's see what else we can find. Uh, we just hit a Ezekiel Elliott uh, die cut number to twenty four. I'm gonna I'll do a recap at the end, Marco. So you'll see, but I don't think we've hit anything crazy. No, no autos yet. I don't think. But we're only half we're we're just hit halfway through, so cool. I think that'll bring it down to two spot, one spot left, unless it's already uh, unless one other person bought another spot. So that's either gonna be sold out or one spot away from being sold out. Either way, I'm sure that'll go. That's cool. Nice, Chris. Was the blue ink was that numbered at all, or is it just uh, just a, is it like the year one autographs where it's just like a parallel and it's unnumbered, but there's likely like a hierarchy on those. Color is a number. Yeah, that's what I thought. Um, Guys, so Obsidian Soccer probably is going to be going tonight, too. The other two that were very close, obviously, were uh, Finest Flashbacks and uh, Optic Choice ba Baseball. Both of those were down to, like, four spots. So, And I know with the uh, Finest Flashbacks, every spot wins you a chance at uh, the Chicago White Sox and all those Luis Robert rookies, um, which, on average, like, from what I've seen are typically coming like one a box. So you could get yourself two of those in this break just for buying a spot and something else. Yeah, I know, Chris. It happens. It happens. But hey, we still got, you know, 20 minutes or so on this break. Hopefully by the time this is done, it'll still push somebody else in the chat to want to come over and do it. It's really nice stuff. Hey, it's not like we haven't given any, uh, people enough opportunity, you know? You know, I, I, I hope whoever picks up those last spots, it gives them some really good luck. And pull them some ridiculous stuff. The cool thing with Optic, too, is it's not just the rated rookies, but you have the rated prospect autos. Like, we did, uh, somebody did a, a personal break on, of it on, uh, on Instagram earlier today. They hit a JJ Blade rated prospect auto for the Marlins. Yeah, it was like the number four overall pick, 2019. Hell of a player. And on top of that, the cards look incredible. I think they're all numbered. Like 99 or lower. Um, not for me, Marco. AJ Epinesa to 99 for the Buffalo Bills. That's going to Tony Regatuso. Justin Jefferson, rookie on deck. 
Taysom Hill to 25. Dual threats. New Orleans Saints. Thomas Rifle. Last spot mojo. So Drew Brees one of one and a Taysom Hill to 25 so far for you. Oh. Oh. Nice. Sam Roll. Turn of the century. Jordan Love. 21 of 25 autograph. Congrats, man. See, Hudson? See, Chris? It's fun that way, right? Uh, Brandon Ayuk to seven ninety nine for the San Francisco Giants. I'm oh, sorry, not San Francisco Giants. San Francisco 49ers. Michael Armstrong. Le'Veon Bell to three ninety nine for the New York Jets. New York Jets, Tom Gatos. You get to drink your morning coffee, eat a little breakfast, watch some breaks. Right? I know uh, I know Sam's not mad about that. Jordan Love, the 25. There you go, dude. There you go. There he is, people. I knew he was here because he was just in here chatting not too long before that. Low number, too, man. Out of 25. LaVisca Chenault to 49 for the Jacksonville Jaguars. Robert Kariki. Uh, this is Javon Kinlaw to 97 for the San Francisco 49ers. And Michael Armstrong. That dude has an awesome story. If you don't know about him, go look him up. Even if you're not a 49ers fan... Even if you hate the 49ers, like a Raiders fan or something like that, or you're a fan of the NSC West, I think you'll root for him. I'm rooting for him. Joshua Kelly to 799, Los Angeles Chargers. Sam Roll. Mike Evans to 13. Super low numbered there. Jersey number low numbered. Four out of 13. Tampa Bay Buccaneers, Peter Lombardo. Christian McCaffrey to 399, Carolina Panthers, Stephen Olson. And Pen Pal Autos, Devin Devernay, Baltimore Ravens, Aaron Billingsley. Derek Henry to 349, Spellbound, Tennessee Titans. That's going to Eric Ainge. I agree, Gabe. I agree. Hey, let them let them develop. Let them develop, and we'll see what happens. I mean, Gardner Minshew, he's fun. Is he the future quarterback there for long term? I don't know. Jalen Johnson for the Chicago Bears to three ninety nine. Chicago Bears, Michael Koontz. Patrick Queen to seven ninety nine. Baltimore Ravens, Aaron Billingsley. Elite Company. We're going to do a randomizer at the end of this to figure out which person this is going to go to. Craftsman, Icky Wood for the Bengals. Going to Glenn Campbell. Teddy, Teddy, send everybody over here. Thank you, Teddy.
Did you put yours in the fridge? Yeah. Two more boxes, guys. Uh, so it looks like Obsidian Soccer sold out. Chris looks like he got the last spot in that. So that'll be coming up after this, most likely, unless uh, one of the other breaks sold out. Like I said, we've got... After that soccer, there were two other breaks that were at least four spots away. Um, we also had that uh, Chronicles Basketball. Um, we had a pick your team that was down to two fillers. One of them where you could win the uh, Memphis Grizzlies. The other one where you could win seven different teams, including the Lakers, Bulls, Wizards, and Knicks. Plus, I think, like, the Milwaukee Bucks and stuff like that. And that was all that was keeping us from doing that, too. Museum collection. I think there was, like, nine or ten spots left in that for, like, a six-box break of that. Cheaper than 250, Chris. Yeah, Gabe. There you go, Chris. Yeah, no, uh, Yankees are cheaper than 250. But I think they were the most expensive. For the Yankees? I don't know. Maybe they were. I think they were still available for flashbacks. Maybe that's what I was thinking. Oh, okay. Yeah, I know that they're still available. I think they were the most expensive team still left in the uh, in that finest flashbacks, and I think they want. I want to say they were like one ten or something like that. Teddy, you gonna come hang out in here and eat? Tell me the highlights of the night over there. I don't know, man. I don't know if I got a lot of highlights to tell you. What do you mean? A lot of soul searching. A lot of soul searching. Yeah? Okay, box five, guys. Good luck, everyone. Xavier McKinney to 49 for the New York Giants and Thomas Rifle. Brian Edwards for the Las Vegas Raiders to 99 turn of the century autograph. That's going to Tony Regatuso. Jonathan Taylor for the Indianapolis Colts to seven ninety nine. Indianapolis Colts is Derek Disser. Brandon Ayuk for the 49ers to three ninety nine. San Francisco 49ers, Michael Armstrong. 
Justin Jefferson, rookie elitist. Remembering. Spellbound, Dalvin Cook, uh, going to the Vikings, and Sam Roll. Sam, there's a little peeling down here on the bottom. Unfortunately, that's kind of common on some of these I've seen, uh, but that is numbered to 75. The other night I pulled, I think, uh, two Christian McCaffrey's that were exactly the same way. Gabriel Davis. Henry Ruggs to is that 89? Yeah, 89 for the Las Vegas Raiders. Tony Rigatusa. Darius Leonard to 47 for the Indianapolis Colts. And Derek Disser. Elite Company, not numbered on this one, so we're going to randomize that with the rest of the group. Uh, Marco, like the penny sleeves or the top loaders? We've been out of a lot of stuff, man. Like, we've barely been getting by with what we need. Akeem Davis Gapier for the Bengals to 799. Uh, Cincinnati Bengals, Tyler Brenner. David Montgomery to 399 for the Chicago Bears. That's going to Michael Coops. Colin Johnson. Rookie to 24 for the Jacksonville Jaguars. And that's going to Robert Garicki. Clyde Edwards Hilaire. Rookie Pen Pals Auto for the Kansas City Chiefs. Rocio El Hamani. El Hami, not El Hamani. And Derek Henry, spellbound. With a little bit of peeling up on the bottom there, right in the middle, same as the other one. To 349, Tennessee Titans, Eric Ainge. Justin Herbert, rookie on deck. That's a nice one for Sam Roll, Los Angeles Chargers, not numbered. Michael Pittman Jr. to 399, Indianapolis Colts, Derek Disser. Brian Edwards to 799, Las Vegas Raiders, Tony Rigatuso. Ezekiel Elliott Swagger, dual relic, Dallas Cowboys. Rick Thomas. That's box five. One more box, guys. Good luck. Um, rank him in the rookie class overall or rank him in the rookie class of, for wide receivers? I mean, it's hard to rank him compared to quarterbacks and everything else as well. You know what I mean? But if you're saying in regards to wide receivers overall, I mean, Marco, that's impossible. You're going to, you like, I think Chase Young overall is a better player than him. I think Jeff Okuda is a better player than him. I think there's a lot of you know, wide receiver quarterbacks that are better than him. More impactful. Wide receiver, I mean, he's probably top four. I think Jerry Judy's incredible. Um, I like LaVisca Chenault Jr. a lot. Um, I think Henry Ruggs was kind of a reach for the Raiders, but we'll see.
I mean, I think the big thing too is who are the quarterbacks that are throwing to these these wide receivers? You know, like uh, like somebody was saying, Lavisca Chanel Jr., Jacksonville Jaguars. He's got you know, big, uh, Gardner Minshew thrown to him, but. Is Gardner Minshew a, a serious long-term option for them? Who knows? I think T. Higgins has really sneaky uh, opportunities with uh, the Cincinnati Bengals. You think about all the all the Bengals options and the Bengals weapons that uh, Joe Burrows is going to have. You know, and there's it always seems like rookie quarterbacks kind of pair up with like a rookie wide receiver pretty well. You know. I don't know if it's because, like, rookie camp or stuff like that or typically what rookie camp is, but this year's a little bit different. But they always get a little bit of extra time together, it seems. So, you know, whether it's, like, the senior bowls and stuff like that. So, I think T. Higgins could be a sneaky good option for a rookie wide receiver. good thing for him is he might not have gone to the biggest school but he played some of the bigger schools so at least he played good there you go two left and op in optic baseball guys that's gonna go two spots left i mean there's something to be said about those last spots guys I don't know who's on the who's on the list for the Mets guys, but I mean, I know that they have rated prospect autos in there. I'm not sure if they have like a Ronnie Mauricio or stuff like that, but he's a good one too. Akeem Davis Gaithier to 7.99 for the Cincinnati Bengals. That's going to Tyler Brenner. We, I think we hit one of these last the other night, too. It's not numbered, but it's got to be like a super short print of some sort. Because, like, it's the only one in the case or like that we pull out of all the boxes we hit. But that's going to the Chicago Bears, David Montgomery. Have no clue what kind of parallel this is. It looks like a tiger stripe kind of looking thing for Prism. Really nice. But uh, Chicago Bears, David Montgomery, uh, Michael Kuntz. No clue what, what that's card. It's a case hit, so if it's a case hit, that means it's got to be really short printed. Aaron Jones to 49 for the Green Bay Packers, Sam Roll. I mean, it looks cool. You got points, so that means that it's going to take away one of the autos. So at the end of the break, we're going to have to randomize those points. So we'll do a randomizer. Top name on the list is going to get those points. Uh, any and all points that come out of this. Hopefully there's not a second set of points in this one box. But Christian McCaffrey spellbound to 349. Carolina Panthers, Stephen Olsen. Uh, Chris Godwin, elite deck. Jimmy Garoppolo to 399. For the San Francisco 49ers and Michael Armstrong. Brian Edwards to $7.99 for the Las Vegas Raiders and Tony Regatuso. 
Antonio Gandy Golden. That's for the uh, Pittsburgh Steelers, Michael Gallucci. No numbering on those, but I'm sure there's some type of hierarchy on those as well. Joe Burrow, rookie on deck. Very nice. Going to the Cincinnati Bengals, Tyler Brenner. Primary colors, relic for the Los Angeles Rams, Jared Goff. That's going to Eric Ainge. Uh, Hudson, the points might replace the other, the on like the other card, the like turn of the century auto. Tom Brady, numbered to eighty-eight, really low number there, for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, Peter Lombardo. Congrats, Peter. Troy Polamalu, tile waves. Josh Allen to 99, dual threats, Buffalo Bills, Tony Regatusa. But it looks like this one was the Pen Pals auto because this is a turn of the century, Brian Edwards auto to 149 for the Las Vegas Raiders and Tony Regatusa. To seven ninety nine. That's DJ Dallas for the Seattle Seahawks. That's going to Thomas Rifle. Last spot mojo. Trayvon Diggs to three ninety nine for the Dallas Cowboys. That is going to Rick Thomas. Wonder if Trayvon covers Stefan at any time. Brother versus brother. George Kittle, Elite Deck. Drew Locke. This is Jalen Ragor to 24 for the Philadelphia Eagles. That's going to David Ross. This is number two. 89, Larry Fitzgerald for the Arizona Cardinals. Nick Galvin. Full throttle, Tom Brady to 349 for the New England Patriots. That's going to Thomas Rifle. Last spot mojo. And guys, that was the break. Got a couple randomizers to do real quick. So bear with me while I get these randomizers ready. So guys, that uh, optics down to the Washington Nationals, last team. Five box break, optic choice. On release day, let's get it going. And then we'll do a separate video for a recap of all like the really super low numbered cards, the um, relics and stuff. And on this one, we're just doing spots one, two, four. Okay, and then just to give you guys an idea of how we're gonna do this, uh, these cards here, these elite company cards. I'm gonna draw a little diagram, just so we know. One, two, three, and four. So 
as you can see, all these elite company cards on the back, it's got four players on there. So what we're going to do is we're going to do a randomizer, and it's going to go just like this. We're going to do one, two, three, and four, whichever number is on top at the end. All of those cards are going to go to this player that's in that spot. So in this case, if they went to number three, they would go to the Los Angeles Chargers. For all the other cards, whatever number, whatever is in that spot is going to be the ones that they go to, okay? So first randomizer is going to be for all the points. Or sorry, first randomizer is going to be for the uh, those elite company. And then the second randomizer is going to be for the points, guys. We're going to do one dice roll. Here is the dice roll for us. And it's a four and a six ten times. So this is for the points. 600 points to the name on top. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, tenth and final time. Those are going to Rocio El Hami. Congrats with that 600 points there for you, Rocio. And now. For the Elite Company cards, we're going to do this 10 times with the same dice roll. 1, 2, 3, and a 4. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, tenth and final time. We're going number 3. The one I used for an example. So, no 1, no 2, no 4. So you guys can see on here. Number three. So in this case, these cards will be going to Los Angeles Chargers, which in that case is uh, Sam Roll, Las Vegas Raiders, which in that case is Tony Regatuso, and the third is going to the Cleveland Browns, and Glenn Campbell. You guys, that's the break. I'll do a recap video separate from this as well. And that was 2020 Panini Don Russ Elite Football Six Box Half Case Break Number Three. Pick your teams. I'm Sean with JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. Separate video is going to show a recap of autos hit the autos relics and low number cards. So we'll see you guys next time.